what in God's name's going on in here? What was that ruckus? I know he had ruckus. I was just in my office. I heard a ruckus. Can you describe this ruckus, sir? Oh, you better watch your tongue, young man. You better watch it. And now, now, back to the Big Dumb Fun Show. Back on the Big Dumb Fun Show. Hang out with us online at BigDumbFunShow.com. Friend, fan, follow us on the MySpace, Google+, YouTube, Twitter, Eventful, Reverb Nation. Google+. Plus. I said that. I, I slipped that in at the front end just because I knew I was going to beat you to it that way. Our timing is off. I'm supposed to say replay in Google+. Plus. Oh, is that what the rules were? That's, that's the rule. Pretty much the that's, rules, yeah. And then you're that's also supposed to, be the bit, you're supposed to be the bit ruiner. Yeah. <laughs> bit ruiner! Bit ruiner! Yes, that's what we have in our little contract. <laughs> okay, so a lot of people don't know this. Uh, J.P. Hunt was also at uh, Rena's uh, engagement party. Yeah. Yes, And that was, was a lot of fun. And you took yes. pictures. Did, Gnurk, did you? were you here for when that was going on? Uh, Did you see that? <laughs> the line dancing? Yeah, the line dancing. Mm, you know what? I missed the line dancing. What, 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 I uh, must have missed the stripper at my engagement ceremony. Yeah. because Yeah, I, I didn't get any there. pictures of him. I don't remember him there. No. Are we even on there? They totally were missing. Oh, not even other one here. No. There you there go. Yeah, oh, you can't even see yeah, that I can't well. See it. Yeah, we'll, we'll post it up that on the Facebook page. They I'm weren't sure everybody can see They that. weren't doing the electric slide there. It's an Indian family there doing the electric sitar. Yeah. I do know you got a picture of my feet. Did we? Yeah. To the left, yes. Did, no, he was taking pictures, not me. No, but we took a picture, the picture that we have of us three. Yeah. Yeah, you were mm. in the photo, too. And you were there. And you were there. I don't remember. Someone's cell phone took it, and there's a picture of my feet in there. I don't remember. I have yet to see that was photo. me. I have yet to see my picture. <laughs> Did you take the pictures? Remember I took a picture of her feet, and I she's telling her friends, he, it's, uh, they're just weird. I think we took a picture of us drinking. Did you? Did you drink? Oh, yeah. Did you eat? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. yeah, they did. Yeah, we did. Oh, yeah. You I sat Because he documented him. it because I think he took a picture of somebody. Took I a picture did not of take a picture of, of you eating, but I did take oh, a picture of you a being but you actually It's a sight to be there. seen. You, you know what's super duper exciting? What's we're going to have track and field day. That's not exciting And we're going to have all. everyone dressed in Batman and Spider-Man. <laughs> 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 Does it go with the comic book? <laughs> I'm kidding. That, that is ridiculous. I'm kidding. And that's for your wedding? No, we're doing a track and field day. Track and field day. These... Bridesmaids are, are gonna get pissed off. They saying. keep having to buy all these things. No, you don't have to wear the tracksuit any day of the week. I, I thought it was a jumpsuit party, not a track and field <laughs> party. Right, now, now it is not unusual for for genre fans to have weddings in costume. Oh yes. I mean there are there are Klingon weddings and there are Starfleet weddings and there's Star Wars weddings and, and all I did, sorts of stuff. I did get the bell dress for the American dress from Beauty and the Beast. Yes. Oh, okay. But did he get the beast outfit? Now that would be the no. Beast, he the, didn't get the, the outfit. Tuxedo. He got the, the beast, beast costume. The piece. He did get the beast. So costume. So when I kiss him, head. he'll turn into a prince. Yeah. yeah. Well, All we'll right. see how that goes. <laughs> Jason P. Hunt. Uh, let's yes. talk about uh, Spider-Man. You know, it, you were in like probably uh, months ago, yeah. and I said I don't I, I don't know about this Spider-Man, and you said eh, it might not suck too bad, and then uh, and then it actually came out, and I was I was waiting. I was I wasn't going to see it, but I was waiting on Facebook for like. This was the best movie ever. Or I was waiting for this movie blows goats, and I heard <laughs> I heard nothing. Like like it was dark. All you I, heard like, was bad. <laughs> what you, you mean on my part or just on, in general? Uh, in general, I got a thousand fans, so I try to keep my pulse on what's going on on Facebook, right? right. And and I heard really. No, nothing, good or bad, about the Amazing Spider-Man. So there I was, was curious. Stuff all over the internet I, about it on Facebook. I don't think it was on Facebook. What? You know, oh, if it's not on Facebook, it didn't happen? Pretty much. Are you yeah. one of those? <laughs> you know you're only getting 20% of your friend's comments. <laughs> yeah, that's I true. don't that's think true. Jeff <laughs> knows that there's something outside of Facebook. There's something called I, the internet. Yes. I don't think he and knows it's, anything it's about it. I am willing to learn. I'm willing to learn. I'm yes. willing to learn. But, so what, you are what allowed to Google did people, on the internet. Did people like Spider-Man? Yay For or the man? most part, yes. Really? Um, there, there, uh, there have been some critiques that the story was a little off center, a little wobbly because some scenes got cut that fit into one of the storylines mm -hmm. that kind of fizzled at the end, but some people are thinking that maybe they might pick that up in the sequel. Okay. So, but uh, yeah, for the most part, I the never most part is, I thought it was a really good good movie. I never good saw movie, it and I heard people say that it was more into like the love it was more of a love story versus more of a Spider-Man type story. Well, the way Mark Webb, the director, approached it was <laughs> as, an, as an origin story for Peter Parker. 
as mm-hmm. opposed to an origin story for Spider-Man. So you go through about the first 45 minutes to an hour and you're you're a, it's a Peter Parker movie yeah. and you know he's meet, you know he meets Gwen Stacy and he's you know dealing with the fact that his parents have left and he's you know now growing up in, in with his aunt and uncle. Hmm. And so you know you've got the high school really smart kid who's kind of an outcast mm-hmm. so they they really do take the time to get the audience emotionally invested in peter parker as a character as a person before they introduce the whole action wow. there was nobody like there was nobody like 30 minutes into it like where's spider-man no no, no, nothing like that. No, so you don't even like see Spider Man until about forty five minutes into the movie, roughly. Yeah. Oh I man, mean, I'll be like, I mean, this he gets bit by all this time. Well, he's he, he's swinging on the web, and it turns out it's Craigslist. <laughs> 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 well, I mean, you know he's going to be Spider Man. You know it's an origin story. Everybody knows he gets bit by a spider. He turns mm-hmm. into Spider Man. Yeah. So there's nothing it. new there. <laughs> so it's it, you have the the thing that you have to bring to the table that's new and fresh is an approach to the rest of the character. You know, everybody the knows outfit, who Spider-Man the is. The outfit but. doesn't look too different. It's not too bad, no. And the, the motions of him swinging through the New York, they don't seem too They're different. actually done, for the most part, in real life. Those are not CG effects like the Sam Raimi trilogy did. Those were. Mm-hmm. This is a guy on a wire. It's a practical stunt. He's swinging through the bridges and he's swinging on the on the that's on pretty, the trucks. That's pretty cool. And, and it does. It looks a lot better. I mean, the the effects on Sam Raimi's films were really impressive, mm-hmm. and that served its purpose in getting us into the ability to do all of these other superhero movies that we've seen afterwards. Yeah. But this one, he's he, you know, he's practical. It's a practical stunt. He's actually there in the space, swinging on the web. So Brian, it's, it's Brian, really good. Uh, Brian Stewart in our uh, Facebook accounts uh, wrote in reply to our video about talking about Spider Man was that uh, that Spider Man was spoiled for him when he when he saw it ten years ago. <laughs> 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 well, and and people are wondering why, why they'd did, bring it. Did we need this remake? Did well, we, did we need it? It's a rights thing. Sony needed to make something in order to retain the rights to the character or it would revert back to Marvel. And so the question became whether or not they're going to do a Spider-Man 4 with Sam Raimi and Tobey Maguire Mm -hmm. or if they're going to reboot the character and do something else. The fact that they did the reboot seems to indicate to me, and a lot of people are speculating, that, that Sony and Disney and Marvel might be close to a deal where they could share the character. Because, because ideally, Spider-Man is maybe in the Avengers 2, which is like 2014-ish. Yeah. Maybe, yeah. So they may be able to hash something out before production starts in 2013. Maybe. 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 All right. I still think we have more to talk about. I know. We I need to so. talk about Batman 2 coming out. No. Batman That's like three. this week, isn't it? Yeah. 